YouTube might not work tonight. He's been acting weird today. Um, I went to go, like, post today's video, and I kept getting the stupid, like, monkeys are working on it error. No, I've been getting that, too, especially when I try to upload to directly to uh, YouTube. Mm. Okay. Yeah, it's something's going on. It's, uh... So I haven't been able to post today's video yet today because I, I, I watched it. Everything's ready to go. I just can't edit it to say that it's out. Um, I don't know if my post went live. I'm going to say that it did. Yes, it did. Okay. So. Okay. So now, the fun part... Uh, I'm going to watch the links. stream, but I'm going to be low-key mad that I don't have Overwatch to play it on the PS4. Oh, you don't have it on the PS4? I don't. I don't have... I've been, like... Whenever Overwatch going to sell, and people have been telling me, get Overwatch, get Overwatch, I was like, look, I don't have money, okay? Because I haven't been able to find a, a, jo a job down here. And then recently, some some happened. Whatever. Okay, I'm not gonna really say next, next time it's on sale, if I gift it to you, Will you play it with me? Look, I have an open policy, and I've been saying this for years now. When it, especially when it comes to let's plays and video get, videos I do on YouTube or even stream, if you give me a game, any game, I will play it. If you want me to write a review about it, I will write a review about it. I don't want you to write play, a review. I just want you to play with me when I play it, dude. I'm like that's my open policy, and and and, and, and I won't be one of those weirdos who's like, oh, I bought you this game, and the one time you can't play with me, you're not gonna play with me. No, I'll be like, okay, whatever, we'll no, play dude, another time. Dude, dude, like I, like I am down to play multiplayer games Ooh. forever. Like I was. Thank so you, upset Oni, for hosting I... the stream. I was like, the I was. Only way you pay attention to me. I mean, we do pay attention to you, but we also pay attention to the bronze Only, Dragon, but that's also Only. a bad thing. Do you know what? You know what's something I wish you would pay attention to? What? The goddamn chat. <laughs> I literally put literally like eight minutes, when, no, more than eight me. minutes before. Excuse you said no stream tonight. I said stream's gonna start late, unfortunately. Oh well, excuse Nightman me. Nightman even crazy. responded and said no problem. So you couldn't. T you you decided to type a message before <laughs> you before you looked at what was in the chat. No I stream tonight, even though the last two messages were about the stream that's gonna be late. <laughs> even Blondie said after that it's gonna be late. Oni, what the fuck? Oni, Oni, we need to talk. I, I swear to God. Oh, I just... I, I'm i kidding. I'm not, I don't mean to give you crap. I just... I know, I know. It's just, I know, it was just funny. I'm just like... I'm just like... And part of me was just like... Part of me was just like, watch Oni say that... that say, oh, you're not streaming tonight? Can I stream? That's what I thought you were going to do. No, I wasn't going to say, can I stream tonight? Because I'm, I was kind of busy with... Yeah. You know. I, I said last night after my stream... Um, that I was going to try to stream tonight, but at the same time, I woke, I, I got up today, and I was like, I got to do all my grocery shopping, all that kind of stuff, nice. the food and stuff like that. They but... give you a loot box. Nice. I'm gonna open it up. Open the loot box. Okay. Open it, fucker. Okay. Well, you guys, you guys are my good luck charm. Let's hope I get something. Uh, don't, 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 get... don't. What am I don't... good luck charm for? Opening up a loot box. Um, don't I got money. Fifty dollars. I got a voice line for a character I don't use. Oh, Overwatch. Okay. I got a victory pose for Widowmaker, who's a character oh, I don't use, is. and I got a spray. Oh, see, that's kind of neat. I'm gonna equip that one. It's going right here. Too bad I don't uh, use me. I actually never played that game. I I want to say something because you know last last Halloween. Last Halloween event, Doomfist was not around. So this Halloween event, they actually gave him a new a new Halloween skin. Yeah. But unfortunately, the Halloween skin was basically they they released it early so people could see it. Um, the Halloween skin is a if I remember correctly, is a sea monster. And as soon as they posted it on Twitter, uh, so many people was tweeting at them talking about the shape of water. 
and it was the most hilarious thing. Oh man, ever. is there no new diva skin? Overwatch is that like Goldeneye, but with Overwatching? Old man Brandon, who let you in here? <laughs> I remember when it used to be Goldeneye. Okay. <laughs> Kami shows up. Is that you, Edith? Is that uh, you? Zero, zero uh, check the check the chat. Not the. I'm not spending no forty dollars on this game. What? Wait till it's on sale. Blizzard usually puts it on sale, and you can buy Wait, it. What do you What do you What do you mean, Oni? I mean, uh, you didn't hear about it. Hear about what? The P uh, PlayStation Network IDs. We can change them. Oh, I can actually make my name Zero Master now. Yeah, and I can make my own Rakaku now. So, so, and I can... oh. so, so. Okay, so because you weren't around probably for this brand, but a lot of people weren't. So, when I was when I got my PS3 and I had to make my PlayStation Network account, I tried to use Zero Master. They said it was inappropriate. You, it is inappropriate. It's so lewd. There, you are very inappropriate. And <laughs> I'm just like, what, what? And then I looked at, it, I'm like, do they mean the word master? Cause that could be said, say, or whatever. It's just like, and then I started. Uh, I'm like, all right, well, what do I choose? I guess zero sunset. That's usually my fallback. Um, and then I started seeing people who got fucking like words like booty in their name. I'm like, come on, how is that allowed? So, you know, going, guys. Hey, also, hey, hi, hey, man. Hey. This is a you know what? Uh, it's coming soon, so it's like we'll keep. You, I'll keep you updated on it. But as soon as it happens. I'm changing everything to Oni Rakaku. I'm going to be like, fine. Oni, right. you'll always be Shattuck 23X to me. And you you just, <laughs> just spread that around like okay. well, fucking wildfire. If, if I'm, if I'm uh, listening to uh, Zero uh, stream, then that can only mean I'm on one site looking at random things. Oh, my God. <laughs> Again? <laughs> Again? Hell, I changed my name to Tommy Dreamer. Hey, it updates more. all the time. Terry yeah, Funko I, Pop. Um, ah! I, is there any? It's still skill? weird, but it's updated weird. I'm Just, not. I'm not Sonic or Shadow. I'm Shadow. <laughs> <laughs> That's not from that Nazo one, the voice acted version, isn't it? Yeah. That's what I thought. <laughs> I, that just sounded so weird when it was just like combined. It was like. Two I'm combined. not Sonic. I'm my original character, Blonic. Blonic the Hedgehog. Blonic. Yeah. Do not steal. Don't steal so, that. Okay, I need to equip the witch skin for this because it's Halloween. So, um, right. Zero, I'm going to let you know that a future project that we're going to be working on, I'm going to sit here and try to re-familiar myself with the game because it has been it has been ages since I've actually played this game. Yeah, it's uh, I play it on and off, but I'm surprised I've stuck with it as long as I have. I want that goddamn Soldier 76 skin. That's all I'm saying. That's one that wait. I'm just like, I have to have. Wait, he... wait. Are, are, are we talking about the same thing? Overwatch? No, I'm talking about God Eater. Oh. Oh, yeah, God Eater, right. Yeah, I just booted up my completed file, which... Have I completed every single mission? Yeah, that 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 Jason thing. Yeah, I want that. Fuck. Anyways, enough of this. I'm just gonna start playing the game because it's almost 9:30 and I haven't uh, done any gameplay yet. You people and your Wait, East Coast. I'm gonna go to arcade because I can get me some loot boxes. Oh. Uh, what was that? I will. Oh. I will. I oh, will I got a cheer. Yeah. Oh yeah! I, I, I forgot I hit Twitch affiliate. You yeah. son of a bitch! You did. Don't go also, all Chris uh, Chan here. <laughs> 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 Thank you very much for the cheer. I appreciate it. Thanks, I'm, honey. I am. I am. Cur I am currently Ow. an app. I'm. I'm only a 1.5 average viewers away from being an affiliate as well. That's my Which first cheer, this, guys. This uh, this special. calls for a Kermit, yay! Yay! Okay, let's see. And it came from somebody I respect. Uh, <clears throat> um, look, 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 look. If you're going to be a bitch about it, don't even bring it up again. What? Like someone you respect? Mm -hmm. Like you, you, you're so obvious it hurts. Maybe what? he just doesn't want to make it public yet. I did make I, it public. I am not playing fucking Torb on this. Fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> 
Look, you, if you made it public, then why are you like, why, why are you so bad about saying, stop talking about it? Good point. Like literally, like literally, if my girlfriend came in this stream right now, I'd be like, hi, honey, I love you. I don't want to embarrass her. Jeez. It's that, not a, well, it, well, it's your right. It's, it's, up. It's, it's your right as your boy, as the boyfriend. Okay. And it's, it's just like, it's, it's just like, let's her see if right I remember how to play this. Man, I'm taking so much damage. So much damage. That's a lot of damage. Oh yeah, Nightman, I saw that uh, intro that you shared for uh, oh, in index? the RCG chat oh. for Index Three. Man, oh, yeah. I really gotta finish Railgun S and Index Two. <laughs> you do. It's so good, man. Also, I hope this means. Uh, if this doesn't mean we're getting another Railgun season, I hope we get a lot of. Oh. Uh, Railgun season three is also confirmed. Is it okay? Good, because I'm. Yeah. I'm gonna be honest. I like the, the railgun storyline more. I, I kind of like them both the same in their own uh in their own uh, ways. Uh, they're also making a spinoff for Accelerator too. So. Oh really? Because yeah. Accelerator's a really interesting character. Oh yeah, he is. He's I awesome. I'm glad I didn't watch uh, Index first, though, because, like, they pretty much, like, he pretty much gets annihilated in Index. I yeah. watched Railgun first, and then it, it, it made his character a lot more hyped up for me. I kind of have yeah. this thing where I try to yeah. watch the Railgun seasons first, so I might, by the time I finish Railgun S and Index 2, it, Index 3 might be done. <laughs> you know what, that's actually a good thing, because uh, then you could just marathon it, so. Yeah. Um... Hmm. But yeah, I'm so hyped. I can't wait for the simul dub too, because I kind of prefer Index in English. I know yeah. that's kind of blasphemy for a lot of anime fans, but actually, it's it's funny. Normally, I'm all for dubs, but Index and Railgun is one of those things where I just kind of prefer it subbed. Yeah, which is fine. I mean, like I appreciate the dub, but it's one of those things where that show just I don't know. That one I never clicked. I think you know what it is. Yeah. Um, oh, what's the one girl's name? I always get her name. I forget her name. Um, uh, the, uh, Misaka or something? Or? Not Misaka. The other one who lives with her. Kuroko? Kuroko, yeah. Like, the way they... Like, I don't like the way they trans... Like, her character, like, is done in the dub. And I think that's one of the reasons. Because she's my favorite character. Because she's fucking ridiculous. <laughs> well, to be, to be fair, though, you can't exactly like, top that voice anyway, so... There are some shows that are just better subtitle, you know, better in Japanese, and some are better in English. It just it really depends yeah. on the show. Yeah, and it's also like, a very subjective thing too. So. Well, like I, I can't watch Fruits Basket in Japanese because some of the voices are just just awful. Holy mm. crap! The Junkenstein's monster can move fast for a fat guy. Holy crap! Uh, so okay, I watched I got the. In my sights. Oh. I, got in, I got interested in Index's dub mainly because the guy who voices Toma was also Soul Eater. So. Yeah. Oh wait, wait, wait. Uh, Soul Sod is uh. Micah. Wait, Micah? Yeah, yeah, Micah's fucking. Oh Lord, Micah's in something Toma? else. God, I'm so jealous. Of oh God. He's been in like stuff for years, man. Well, yeah, the, th know, the thing I is, know. Brandon's God, told me all about because voice acting alliance, buddy. Yeah, because Brandon's think... been friends with all these guys. It's just he hasn't been in the voice acting scene. Yeah, you, no. You right the voice God, acting friend, scene for a bit. I'm, I'm friends with all these fucking people. It's hilarious. Like I'm friends with, I'm nice. friends with Kira Buckland. I'm friends with uh, uh, Lucian Dodge. We're talking about uh, Index Three, dude. What? <laughs> I'm telling. I'm telling Billy in the chat. He's like, "What anime? Index." Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, fucking Junkenstein. I hate him. Oh. Uh, I, oh, I he doesn't look that bad. Why is he floating? You know what? I did want to share that. I did want to share that. Uh, I, I am, I am officially forty pounds lighter than I was at the beginning of the year. Nice. Oh, nice. Congratulations. Well, what's your secret? What's my secret? Push up, sit ups, uh, and plenty of juice. I mean, I mean, if you want to be technical, yes. But like, I've actually just cut down on just what I eat. Like, I eat, I eat roughly. I want to. I don't want to say roughly the same amount. But like I do eat enough that uh that to, to get like oh I'm no I never eat to Reaper get full again. I eat to get stated if that makes sense. Welcome I, to the club, good sir. I know how you feel on that one, dude. Because well, my added thing is I don't eat a lot of sugar now too. So 
and I lost like a good bit since April. I'm now down to 218. So. Well, I, I'm a I'm a I'm a big boy. <laughs> I'm a big hey, I was boy a, hey 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 I was a big boy too. So. Well, so was I, and I went from Whoa. two. I went from two thirty. I I've I've been taking it more seriously oh, recently right because I. Uh, it's let, let me put it this way, it's starting to hurt more to walk. Yeah, no, it, it really does. When 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 you're really big. What kind of like juice that? did he drink? <laughs> <laughs> uh, he drank a Ipecac. Lots and lots of Ipecac. Oh, God, no. What's no, Ipecac? Uh, no, um, I got the reference. No, stop that. Oh, I, I was I was going to say, I was going to say, who drank the last heat tap? No, uh... Oh, no. no. But basically, oh, um, no. I, for, for a short while, I was substituting oh, off like, I normal move. breakfasts for... Uh, I'm substituting, substituting normal breakfasts for like like breakfast smoothies, and that's that was, that's idea. really good too. Like just getting a nice dose of just uh, uh, getting thanks a nice for hosting dose, me, man. Ah, oh, you're welcome. Getting a nice dose of like vegetables and How like. Is she not dead, guys? Come on. She has the force. That is the lamest excuse yet for Overwatch. The summoner is no more. But yeah, uh, by the way, thank you, honey. There you go. See? Yeah. There so you I go. I didn't want to embarrass her. I mean, I mean, I, I mean, look. Look. There is nothing embarrassing about showing love. Thanks for hosting, Billy. Appreciate it. There I is... know. I just, I know that. I just. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, it's dead. I was wondering why I was like, why is this thing not moving? Oh, I killed it. <laughs> That's usually how I feel when playing games like this. Um, but no. I'm up here, I'm up for practicing because I, I use only one weapon set in the game, and that's the DLC weapon set. And God Eater. What the fuck? Oh, there's two of them? There's two Junkensteins. Shit. That's not good. Mm. Wait, Junkenstein or Junkenstein's monster? I mean, monster? Junkenstein's monster, that's what I meant. I was about Sorry. to say. Freudian slip. Well, I mean, everybody does that mistake with Frankenstein anyway. Oh, yeah. Unless you're watching young Frankenstein. Um, unless unless you're watching, um, what is it, Fate Zero? With with Frankenstein's monster? Oh, yeah, <laughs> that's true. Oh, I'm about to die. <laughs> this is not good. You yeah, know Fate what? Zero is such a great show. I think I think that's like the only reason why I'm I'm, I'm like sort of into like the Fate series and, and stuff like that. It, like that oh, kind of dead shit. That kind of that piggybacked is... off of that kind of that kind of fad is because I like the idea of like these characters being like the over these over the top anime. No, shit. no. did we fucking just lose? It's great. No, we did. Fuck. Oh man, I've never beaten this Junkenstein thing. I've never beaten it. God. Who got play in the game? That's what I want to know. Oh, it was me. Go work, soldier. Of course, it was when I used my ult. <laughs> I've got you in my sights. Oh, uh, Vegeta. If you're there, Brandon, oh, he's not there. Damn it, he left. Or he's on mute. Hey, is it a free mute. play week for uh, Overwatch on PS4 this week, or no? No, they, um, I think they already did that. Damn it. Yes, I got a loot box. Mm. I leveled up. I'm going to try Junkenstein one more time, and if I can't get it, I'll move on to other things. Because I've, uh, losing it so many times last time just hurt my pride. Wait, am I supposed to use the vine on this enemy? I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to use the the vines, the hives, the white stripes. Take your pick. There you go. Bum, 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 bum. No, son of a bitch. No, not Oracle Drain. Dun, dun, not Oracle dun, dun, Drain. Two time and touching broken bones. Dun, 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 two time and touching. Oh, I just keep, I keep, I keep thinking of uh, Seven Nation Army. It's like I'm that's the first song I learned how to play on guitar. Oh hmm. my god. I wish we could sing it on here, but then Twitch would be like, nope. Yeah, this isn't Singly or whatever that fucking app is. 
Singly. What the hell is Singly? I, I can't remember on. if it's called Singly or what it's called. Music, musically. Musically. Oh, that's what it was used oh. to be called. Okay. That's. I think that's what it's called. I think I just messed. Yeah, it I um. I actually watched a video about that from a guy named McJuggernuggets or something like that. Oh, McJuggernuggets. Oh. McJuggernuggets. It just, he was saying something about his girlfriend. Him, it, was, it was like a couple years ago, though. Him and his girlfriend was like at Disney World something. He didn't even know. He he saw her on the phone. He's like, is she chatting to other men? And then he found out, oh, no, she's doing Musical.ly. And it's like the most embarrassing shit you will ever see in your entire life. <laughs> All right. So I can't be Brigitte. I think on this time I'm going to be Anna. Because... Anna, I've gotten the furthest in Junker Size Revenge as Anna, so. And I have to use the ghoul skin. It's the appropriate. It's the appropriate skin for this. Alright, we already saw that. I'm gonna skip that. Unless the other two players don't skip it. Why aren't you dead? I'm doing about like six, 60,000 damage to you. Um. Because I'm alive? Stop living! <laughs> oh god, I gotta introduce you to all the God Eater memes. So like, don't on. give up on Renny living. Are you supposed to always defend the door, or...? Yeah, we... Uh, for this, for Junk Science Revenge, yes. Um... It, this is this is this is basically the tower defense mode for this one. This is why I'm not a big fan of this, because I'm not a big tower defense guy. But we do have somebody who's actually a good Torb on our team, so... It seems like we got a pro Torb. Alright. Alright. All 17 monsters are dead. Okay. This is actually a pretty good team. We got... We got a... Um, we've got a fucking... Oh, you're critical. We got a... Um... Okay. Since we're talking about, like, old YouTube in a way, um... I do want to ask this question if nobody minds. What's the old YouTube shows you used to watch before they just became irrelevant for the time? Whoa, whoa, whoa. who shot now? Uh, the... I didn't really watch too many shows, but I did watch this one Let's Play. It was uh, it was uh, Mega Man Seven by a Zero Master. I'm not sure if you heard of this guy oh, yet. Oh God, shut up. <laughs> um, I think a YouTuber I used to watch all the time that's kind of become irrelevant is Make Me Bad Thirty Five. I used to oh, love his me. shit. Oh fuck! I forgot about Make Me Bad. He, he was the guy who did uh, um, Wooden Alligator and Magical Giraffe, and I mean, it's not very, it's not a very topical show now. But he also did, he also did a, a video called Gay What's Ghost, <laughs> and one, just one of the lines always gets me. He's like, "You ready for my spooky cock?" And I'm like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> There was one called. Oh, um, I'm dead. It used to call J Pizzle, Shit. but now it's just going by Jog Wheel. And they used to do a thing called "Is it a good idea to microwave this?" Is it a good? I remember that show. I used to watch that. Yeah. Yeah, it was like awesome. They would just put anything in the microwave, and it was I like. I wasn't really a YouTube guy back in the day, though. I was really oh. more of a Newgrounds guy. Br Brandon. Same. Brandon. Yeah. So I'm going to Yomicon uh, at the end of the month. Guess who's going to be there? Um, someone Bob you won't the builder. No, someone you won't shut up about. Lisa Ortiz. Lisa Ortiz. <gasps> oh my yeah. God, Lisa Ortiz! <laughs> oh what should God, I do? My, my voice actor crush. What, what should I do? Like what? What? What do you? Um, besides hug her. Uh, <laughs> 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 I'm sorry, she's my favorite voice actress. I figured you'd be. I figured you'd be. Like, I was gonna be like, do you want me to get like a video clip or a video message to send to you or something or what? No, I don't want to do embarrass you or stuff like that. That's it's fine. Why would it embarrass um, me? I think it'd be cool. <laughs> whatever. I mean, yeah. I mean, I you know, I don't embarrass you. Whatever you feel like doing. Like, but, like, yeah. get, get get Lisa Ortiz to say in one of her famous voices, "Double Sunday." There you go. Oh, do you guys know Lisa Ortiz? <laughs> yeah. Uh, Lena Inverse from the Slayers. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Uh, I knew that. I knew that name sounded familiar. I just, I just like I, everything. Like I love her stuff that she just does. Like uh, she was also Serenity from Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah, she was also, Karomi um, and animation runner Karomi. Yes, Karo. Of course, well, they wouldn't know that one. They wouldn't know that one. Uh, <laughs> you just, you just, you, you're just at the point where you're just like nobody knows that show. I, I, you and me know Karomi, and that's about it. 
<laughs> well, because we watched it together. Yeah, ex exactly. That's why, yeah. But no, she was in record of Lodos War. She was actually Sonic X. She was actually- Oh the yeah, one, she was the, aiming. The, the, uh, the good One Piece dub. Uh, she's Tony what? Tony Chopper. She's Noem yeah. Blue. Noem Bellu from Street Fighter V. I will go to the grave stating that Mark D. Ryson is Zoro. I'll just go to the grave saying I that. I mean, yeah. Even though the dub was terrible. She she was she was one of the, the best. The script Pokemon. wasn't good, but the, the, his voice was amazing uh, but for it. The, the highlight of that is that he barked like a chicken as Zoro. <laughs> <laughs> Actors that I need to hear bark like a chicken in real life. That's number two. Well, no, no, no. I, and, uh, don't, for, don't forget that um, it was, uh, it was Yugi. It was Yugi who said cluck like a chicken in the hentai. Yeah. Maybe, maybe I should get Lisa Ortiz to say something that. about, like, s s something uh, from Animation America Romy. Because that one would be, like, just you and me. That or Comic Party. That or I Comic Party. I didn't. I didn't realize she voiced one of my favorite Rocket Team Rocket members in the entire continuity. Well, she was also Sabrina. Yeah, but she she voiced she voiced Oakley from Pokemon Heroes, and that was probably oh, one yeah, of my yeah, favorite. Oh yeah, from from uh, Pokemon Heroes. I actually like Latios and Latios, so I actually like that movie. I don't know. I like, she was I like Daisy the movie. in Pokemon Chronicles. I got very, I got very, very sick of uh, of the Pokemon movies though because it was Ash inserting himself in situations he had no business being. Okay, but I I must implore you, as a fan of the Pokemon movies themselves and not the show, watch the reboot series of the movies. There's basically movie twenty on. There's twenty of them. Geez. Yeah, I know. That's yeah. what I thought when I saw it. Um, I've seen. I saw. I saw up to six. I gave up after Jirachi because Jirachi was so bad. I was like, I'm done. Um, there were there are more Pokemon movies than Dragon Ball movies. That's sad. I w but it made okay. me so sad because like I was like watching like Pokemon Forever and like Professor Oak was having like his little movie. He was enjoying himself and Ash is like, Hi, I'm here too. We're like, Ash, go the fuck away. <laughs> this is not your movie. <laughs> Did you think the same way when you saw Mewtwo Strikes Back? I, I, yeah, they changed the voice actor. They didn't get the original guy. They got Dan Green to do it. Mm -hmm. I miss. What happened to the original guy? He like did the Pokemon movie and then just evaporated. Ash the has been Earth. ten for the past twenty years. I'm starting to believe the coma theory. <laughs> oh my god, that that creepy pasta one. No, yeah. actually, him being in a coma makes a lot of sense. It really does. Thanks again for the cheer. Appreciate it. Mm. Okay, so this is what I'm saying. Um, watch the. Watch the alternate continuity, which is movies 20 to 21, which is basically a retelling of the of Ash's journey, but not with um, Misty or Brock or any of the other characters. And it's more concrete. I actually and, like, can't. OK, as long as it's not in that new style. It's what you don't like Sun and Moon style. The Sun and Moon oh, animation so style. Cool. It's kind of oh, weird. I, yeah. Like I sat down and watched it and I was like, I didn't like the style. I didn't like the style. But once I actually started watching like more and more episodes, both in English and Japanese, I'm like, okay, this fits the Pokemon style more than the rich than they what they were doing for it's X so and Y. It's so wiggly and goopy and ugh. It's 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 more it's more children animated. But the thing is Re with with this with this new style, they're they're allowed to give the characters more facial expressions. I mean it's funny, recently I saw a Sakuga compilation, and I'm thinking the entire time, you know what? Brandon would just love this, and in terms of love this, he, would, he wouldn't he would shut up about it the entire time. he be like, it's all flubity! <laughs> oh, 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 that fucking, that stupid, that flubity, fl yeah, the flubity, flubity no jutsu, yeah, that fucking thing, I hated that animation, I hated it. <laughs> um, no, that's also Zoro's attack, flubity, flubity. Oh, that's right, flubity, flubity, yeah. that's right. Um, <laughs> I, I will to, the, to my grave. I will still love that joke more than anything. Check out my Kuina. <laughs> <laughs> That's well, uh, top ten, uh, top ten Vegeta thirty nine eighty six jokes ever made. I love that fucking joke. Um, that'd be a cool yeah. a April Fool's Day video. You could do my top ten favorite jokes I made. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, yeah. Uh, I can put that in there. But just to, just to wrap up this conversation, for those who have not watched any of the Pokemon movies past. Uh, a lot of the like a lot of the like, higher numbers the diamond and pearl series three movies are probably one of the better ones because they're not ash being oh, God, not somebody ash get the witch. Burn the not witch. Ash, it's not ash 
inserting himself into the situation. It's more like Ash is minding his own business and the situation inserted themselves into him. And that sounds really dirty. <laughs> no, that's what happens. And a really good, a really good uh, movie. Oh, I'm dead. Fuck. Um, don't watch anything for the X and Y series. Because except for except for movie nineteen, which is Volcano and the, the Mechanical Marvel, because that's probably one of my best, one of the better movies out of all nineteen movies in the in the game continuity. That's what I'm going to call them, the game continuity of Ash. God, we're going to lose again. There are, only, there are only two series that I've seen more than ten movies of, and that is Dragon Ball and Land Before Time. That is it. That's not fair because everyone has seen ten movies of Land Before Time. <laughs> I've, I've seen all fourteen. Okay. Ugh. Okay. Here, here's here's another movie series that has multiple has more than more than ten movies that no one should ever say they've watched all of them. Scooby Doo. Ugh. Ugh. Nothing beats like four. nothing beats the uh, um the curse of the island or whatever the one's called oh, the zombie, zombie one? one that was a good one yeah, that was a good yeah. that's my favorite Scooby -Doo okay movie. okay but the latest one that they're they were marketing i, I remember correctly it was uh scooby-doo versus it's scooby-doo and the ghoul something or another i can't remember it was not ghoul school and the, oh okay Wait a minute. It, wasn't, I, it wasn't it wasn't ghoul school but basically the, the celebrity guest stars in this one was Bobby Flay and another cook and I was like Oh okay. yeah that one. Oh, yeah. The only thing I know Bobby I Flay know. from is Beat Bobby Flay. Uh, the WWE well, crossover Scooby Doo movies got uh, wasn't wasn't there like a crossover with Kiss recently? Yes there was. Oh, do not Okay. I'm a quote I'm gonna quote someone a YouTuber that I don't like. Watch if you ever gonna watch the Scooby Doo versus Kiss thing, watch everything. And then get off uh, before the the very end of the, the very end of the movie. <laughs> Do not finish that movie. It's a, it's dumb though, because like Kiss makes a lot of songs about sex. So why would you cross Scooby Doo over with that? Oh God, I don't even want to talk about the WWE crossover with the Scooby Doo movie. There's a lot of oh. WWE crossovers. Like when they crossed yeah. over with Surfs Up, I was like, who is clamoring for a Penguin movie sequel? Who is oh, no, 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 no. Nobody. Who is even asking for a crossover with WWE on that one? Fuck that. Oh, don't forget, don't forget, there's also a, a, a WWE crosses over with the Flintstones. And the Jetsons. Uh, and, and the, the Jetsons, Jet yeah. Jesus Christ, like, they don't know what they're doing. See, they I kind of like Scooby-Doo better when it wasn't as mystical. I liked it better when they could solve the mysteries. No, the thing is, the mysteries, the mysteries in, like, the late, in the, I guess, I guess I want to say... The later, the later shows, and so, the later movies, and so like that could be solved because they were, um, they were just literally guys in the mask. Still, they weren't myth mythical or mystical. It's just that whenever they did mystical stuff, it got stupid after the Witch's Ghost. I'm still gonna yeah. vote that the best Scooby Doo series is still the Thirteen Ghosts of Scooby Doo. Thank you. That's such show a great show. Oh my god. You know when Scrappy actually did shit. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, what was? Oh my God! I'm on a team of bastions. It, uh, uh, what was the uh, name of the the little guy that was with them? That was basically their friend for oh, the series. Oh yeah, that was. Um, um, no, no, no. Uh, Flim Flam. Flim Flam. Flim Flam. That was his fucking name. <laughs> that was also that was also that was also chubby chubby Daphne, and I don't understand why they they, they chose to do that. Like, I remember just Daphne being, like, drawn really chubbily during the entire series. And it ended on a cliffhanger, which pissed me off. Yeah, that was kind of kind of lame. A, a lot of those, you know, the biggest problem with, like, let's go find shit ends on cliffhangers. Or, like, anytime there's a certain number of shit you have to get done, it'll end on a cliffhanger. Like, uh, 100 Good Deeds of Eddie McDowell. That just kind of ended. Kind of just ended. Was it, yeah, wasn't that because, like, nobody watched it, though? Yeah, but the problem is, you, you sh it, just because you give yourself a number, an arbitrary number, doesn't mean that the number will get the, the have enough episodes to finish. Yeah. I mean, I mean, they kind of expected they kind of expected that he, it, he they would get a hundred episodes out of it. I mean, and, and actually, I don't think they could have just stepped the stepped around. They're like, oh, no, this his number right now at the start was a hundred, but like you know, seven or eight uh, episodes, and he's down at forty six. I'm just like. Okay, he might have just done stuff off screen, and that would have been totally acceptable. Mm. Yeah, but they try to make it like one an episode, and I was like, yeah, no, <laughs> you're not gonna not make gonna. it, guys. <laughs> you're not gonna yep. make it. Nickelodeon won't allow it. 
Like, I must... I'm really sure that was called, uh, I don't know if I watched it, it was called Brimstone. It was about a guy who had to return souls to hell. That was like, that went on for one season. He got like eight out of a hundred souls back. Oh, man. But like, sometimes they just create shows that shouldn't need to exist. Like the reboot reboot. Of uh, what? Oh my no. god. The no, show reboot. reboot. Yeah. Oh, the reboot reboot. Oh, okay, okay. Actually, it, it, it was, it started off as a reboot of the series, but then like in the middle of like, I think it was like season one or season two, they went back to the original computer and they got, um, it was like Bob was back and everything. It was just, it was crazy. Now I'm just trying to imagine what this show, the Starfield just said is, Bojack, Bob's Burgers, Overlord, and Steins Gate, oh, all oh. in one show. Oh, all right, God. it's about this evil guy who uses the Steins Gate to travel, to send messages through time to Bob and Bojack so that they can take over the world through TV and fast food. Why would he give the to Bojack? Of all people, he's gonna <laughs> fuck it up. I don't know, oh, man. Yeah, okay, maybe, maybe Bob, maybe Bob, he gives it to Bob and Bojack's trying to stop him. <laughs> It has to work somehow. And then in the end, everyone gets murdered except for Farris, because Farris is best character. <laughs> and before you ask Billy, no, I haven't seen BoJack season four yet. I'm working on it. I'm watching I, Little Witch Academia right now. I have I have not seen. I have never heard of BoJack Horseman. I've I've seen clips about it, but it's, I've never. Seen it's it. pretty fucked up. Yeah, I hear it's like a show about a drug addiction. Or something. Like the second season, the second fucking season. Holy shit. It's fucking okay. great. The end of the, the finale of the second season is great. And the finale of the third season is actually really good, too. But, fuck, it's great. It just, like, it takes everything you learn about it and twists it on its head. It's, it's great. It's, uh, if I could recommend one adult show, I mean, I'd probably recommend Rick and Morty over that. But I'd say, like, Bob, uh, not Bob's Burger, sorry. I'd say, like, uh, Bojack Horseman is a close second for me. I'm going to be an old man and say if I'm going to recommend one adult show, it's going to be The Critic. Oh, oh yeah. For Anybody fuck's in sakes. Anybody in here ever seen a uh, F is for Family? I've seen commercials for it, but I haven't sat down and watched it. <laughs> oh man, that show's fucking hilarious. I was always a huge fan of Drawn Together. I love that show. Yeah, that was also yeah, a really was a good, good show. show. Yeah, it was. No, just, just something about how far they like. To me, like I like the idea they went super far without having a reason for it. Like. South Park's like, here's a moral, and I'm like, no, I, I don't want a moral or a political commentary, just give me random shit. And maybe yeah. Killing Kenny. Eh, well, I, no, I, I, didn't, I never really liked that. The Killing Kenny joke kind of outstated its welcome. That's why I stopped doing it, yeah. Yeah, they'll still do it once in a while, but they they realized the gag was getting old. I, wasn't, there a time they like, wasn't there a time they were like, oh, Kenny, you haven't died for like two years. <laughs> oh yeah, no, they stopped killing him for a good long time. Yeah, and then there's like, and then they did, and then they decided to like do an explanation as to why he keeps coming back because of the whole, uh, the whole uh, <clears throat> during the whole uh, Coon and Friends uh, episodes. They pretty much explained there's some uh, weird cult shit going on with with that. I think the only South Park, the only South Park episode that I actually really enjoyed watching was the World of Warcraft episode. I think everyone that liked one's good. Everyone oh, that one's funny. Yeah. I love the... I think my favorite, though, is the Scott Tetterman one. Oh, oh God. That one, that one scarred me. That one's pretty fucked up. But... I actually stopped watching the show after that episode. <laughs> that was fucked up. Well, I mean... That's and I, like, kinda... drawn together, and that was fucked up. Well, I mean, it is kind of in Cartman's character to be a horrible person, so... Fuck. Honestly, I'm not a big fan of South Park, but I do like the games. Like, I like Fractured But Whole. Oh, Fractured But Whole is fun. I have yet to play those. Side note, it is the only game I've ever played where I played as a girl. Just, cause, just, for, the, just for the hell of it. Oh, you could, uh... You could sort of be uh, transgendered in the, in the Fractured But Whole. But I just, th I just thought it was really yeah. funny when I, when I chose a girl, yeah. and they're like, so the whole thing about the king and uh, Stick of Truth is really a uh, queen. Okay yeah. then. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Wendy was all like, "Oh, I always knew." And you're like, "Yeah, exactly. hey, hey, CJ, CJ. Oh, I, was girl. Yeah. Hey, CJ. I, I guys, I'm only here for a little while. I'm I'm on break from raid. Holy crap, CJ! I didn't really CJ. I whoa! I didn't even realize that was you at first. Brain fart. <laughs> ah, that's fine. You uh, you like, like ninja in. 
if you I don't assume you want to play Overwatch, do you? I, I want to, but I'm helping uh, uh, fill in for uh, my FC's raid team right now. So oh, okay. We're on break, and I was wow. like, I wanted to... No, uh, Final Fantasy XIV. Um, I just wanted to stop by and say hi. Oh, yeah, Thursday's friends. your raid night, isn't it? It's not all... No, this I'm filling in for uh, another, okay. pe another person, but it used to be. Mm -hmm. But I right today, normally I don't raid anymore, but... Uh, they asked if I could take for them. Fill so I said, yes. Yeah. So I said, yeah, of course. What the fuck? <laughs> She'd be like, no, I'm playing Overwatch. <laughs> 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 what, wait, what do you need? Aren't you max level? Well, I max level, but I need gear. <laughs> gear, dude. Yeah, right? and, and in every MMO, at every single time, the the actual final endgame shit is fucking glamour. So you fucking look good. Except for Warhammer, because that had no end game. <laughs> they just I mean, never finished the end game. I'm, I mean, I mean, that's oh, kind of what I'm doing in in Guild Wars too. But, nah, not really. Uh, but they Actually, have like this is the thing is they have these raids. I haven't some of these raids I haven't cleared yet. And on top of that, like sure I could have like max gear, but I could still do them to help other people clear it. That's how I look at it. Are you getting? Evil the fights gear? are super fun. So there is some evil gear. You can't make your character look God. like a, yeah, a giant. You know Brandon, what? You could have stop. picked up on a CJ and you dropped it. Brandon, dropped stop. It. Stop yeah. trying to make it work. Yeah, and also, <laughs> I don't recognize that as a Tachi. So. <laughs> I am offended. I don't recognize that Atachi, and you know this. <laughs> Until the reckoning, apparently. Until the reckoning. <laughs> Until the reckoning comes. The no, reckoning. No. The reckoning. It's God, like you acknowledging Jabberjaw Kasame. <laughs> I, you know what? I, I, I'm, I'm good with you. With, with, I, I'm, I'm good. Know. He's. I just love how immediately he's like, I'm good. I, I, I'm good. I'm good with you know, like the way that you interpret Kasame over me. <laughs> I didn't do Kasame. So I know. Funny. I know you didn't, but you still let it happen. So I, I, you gotta I, own a little bit of it. I, I just I just want to be a part of any Naruto bridge so I can voice Hidan as like a like a typical black priest uh, creature. Oh, we did that in Akatsuki Unlimited. Uh, Have you like... heard the great word of Joshin? I mean, I started What's doing it. What's a Joshin? Like... <laughs> Is that like a dessert? Who, who let Kami in here? Uh. That wasn't Kami, that was Hokage. They're the same, same person. I mean, I, I've, done, I, I've done the telemarketing thing with him, where he like calls oh. up Itachi and is like, Hey, have you heard what Joshin can do for you? <laughs> uh, oh, I thought you were talking about the time you prank called as, uh, oh, as I Daydara. Oh, I still God. have that audio file somewhere. Oh, that hotel? Yeah. <laughs> Where he's, I was not, trying... he's not a pet. He's oh a... yeah, that was, the whole thing was I was trying to book it for me and Sorcery, but I was like, he likes to live in this in this puppet thing, and she's like, sir, we don't accept pets. Let's keep it <laughs> I'm just like, he's not a pet. He's a person. <laughs> Everybody else figured out it was a prank call really quickly after so some of the hotels that I did. That was back in the Skype days. Oh my god. Oh jeez. That was I gotta find that audio and that you were doing the old Daydara voice for that too. Like it yeah, it's when I was I was like I didn't give him such a high pitched voice. He was more straight back then. <laughs> but he's totally not gay, which is great. He's he's Metro. Hello, person who just joined. Dude, one of these days, I'll get that unreal. Hi, unreal. Hey, unreal. Apparently, Neji's saying this. I don't know why. Did. 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 Dude, Kiba, excellent. <laughs> Dude, is there another me? Did. <laughs> I don't. I don't do that anymore. <laughs> no, that was a one. No, that was a one episode deal. Oh, I was, I was yeah, oh yeah, that was, and that was before we merged. And Kami and, and yeah. Uh, and Bojack. Yar, Bojack. <laughs> Yar, put down 50,000 Zenny on Goku. <laughs> Yar, let me have to hear. 
What is? I have to ask yeah, everyone. That's, here. that's just a no. I, I want to <laughs> ask everyone here who ever done voice voice acting in any capacity. What is the worst voice you've ever came up with? Do Mr. Popo? Oh God. Uh, double Joe. The worst voice. I, oh. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. God. Actually, I actually have one I've voice acted anyway. Sonic. My Sonic sucks. Oh, I know. It yeah. wasn't so much it was a bad yeah, voice, fast. it yeah. was that for some reason, the form editing and the editing of the of my audio was so amazingly bad, it, ma it made me almost cry. <laughs> I did a, a Tales of Symphonia uh, fandom where, uh, where for some reason it just didn't record correctly so everyone else is like crystal chris clear they're you know the crystal clear they're like hi how are you and my character's like anyway i'm like oh fuck. they actually yeah. posted i'm like no let me re-record no yeah no i as much as i like itachi i did a like an actual proper fandom with him once and i realized very quickly that my voice does not suit him but i learned that my voice suit kakashi in that same fandom so I do have to say that I am in a Steam so, game which I have not played because it is an 18 plus game and I don't want to hear that. Uh, you don't uh, want to hear yourself? No, <laughs> no I do not. Really? Dude, you did it. He's in a BL oh, game. I don't, I don't That's why he doesn't want to do it. Record. Be like, oh baby, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if it's if, if it's delivered just like that, I want to play it. <laughs> yeah, like I. Oh I, yeah, I, I want a review copy I of that. I can't dude. wait. I, 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 I like kissing you I'm like, I am playing that. <laughs> I actually have two. I actually have two voices. I was like kind of embarrassed with. I was going to roll with it anyway. Um. The first one was I was casted, and I can't believe I, I was going to say this. It was in the Bridge series. I was casted as a transsexual nun, male to female, and then my my voice hasn't really changed. It was really terrible, and you could thank Soda for that because I was like I didn't I wanted a part, and he gave me, and I regretted every moment of it. <laughs> That's what happens when you ask Soda for stuff. Trauma with uh, with with Micah back in the day. Oh. And, uh, and and he played Tornado Man, and I was Mr. Bagelfish. That what? sounds horrible. Uh, yeah, yeah, it kind of kind of, kind of was. Oh, um, it was it was back in the God. What, what was I can't remember Toplika's real name now. She she's she does shit too. What's her name? Uh, Toplika. God, what is her name? She's like in, uh, she does stuff in like Fun Funimation, I think. Uh, Asian girl, but um. Avatar, you I think it's pronounced. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, yeah, so it was like it was her, Micah, me, and like two other and two other people. I think Kira was it may have been in at one time at one point. Damn. And we did this uh this this whole thing and I was Mr. Bagelfish. <laughs> Mr. Bagelfish. And I told I, I said I told random stories that were terrible. I was like, once upon a time there was a man. He ate peanut butter and died. The end. That was like my entire <laughs> peanut butter and died. <laughs> The well, second, I, don't, I don't call that a bad voice. Like that's just like this is a role that someone. No, got but it was just a really but, like, random show. And then like, uh, and then um, um, another guy I know who does voices, uh, Casey Mongelo. Um, he uh, what he what he he did he, uh, what did he do? He did uh, like this Australian guy where he was like, if you see like if you see a crocodile, go up and pet it with a chicken. You're like really random shit like that. So that was a very weird show I did. What is this, this show called? Uh, it was called Toplica's Treehouse. Topleka Street. Oh my God! Still, is this on like, YouTube? It's still up on YouTube, actually. If it's on YouTube, please send it to me. I want to see uh, this. Three house. In the second one, the second bad voice I'd done was um. <gasps> it is still on here. All right. The second any, bad voice. Any episode of Naruto Shippuden, the abridged series, from one to four, I know for one, I never want to hear myself ever again. Clucky, no! Clucky, no! <laughs> oh my god, no! Don't wake up the neighbors! Oh my god! Uh, Should I just put it in the, in the general chat? Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, okay. There you uh, go. Ah, damn it. That was Toplica's treehouse I was in. This was, yeah, this was with Ayu, uh, uh, Masako, me, and, uh, oh wait, that's right, he was bread, he was bread gun McGee, but he, but he put his, he put a fake name because he didn't want to use his real name. Um, <laughs> The second one was for a cancel project. Uh, it was Justice League Abridged, and oh they, they they had cast they had cast me as John Stewart because you know typecast. Black. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> because black. Yeah, gotcha. <laughs> yeah. Been <laughs> <laughs> a reason. But they um they said they said do do was it his name Phil March Phil March is John Stewart but more racist. 
And the voice I came up with was, Hello there, I'm Jon Stewart, you jive turkeys. And they <laughs> ran with it. Oh god, I'm frozen. Oh god, I'm frozen. Like, I actually used I the word jive today. I actually used the word jive turkey, and I regret every moment of it. What is a jive turkey? It's know. an old fashioned like, 70s <laughs> urban reference or something. Just saying, uh, yeah, it's, it, it's, a, it's, a, it was an old ethnic, uh, I went out, I don't want to say insult, but it kind of was to people who weren't cool. They were just okay. jive turkeys. Like, it's like, oh, be there, be square, or you are just a jive turkey because you weren't there. You know who I bet you could do a really good impression of is probably Dunky. I, I hear Dunky a lot. Wait, video game Dunky or yeah, Dunky? Yeah. From... <laughs> oh, yeah, neck too, baby. <laughs> oh. Yeah, boy. You need to be from New York if you want to do the perfect one. No, the real best game around is Super Mario Brothers 2. <laughs> <laughs> I love Donkey. I need to I see his new video like on Assassin's Donkey Creed. Style, I, know. His, I haven't seen his Assassin's, Assassin's Creed, Creed video yet. Sakura! Get in the chat! Do it! Oh my god, it's Ow. Sakura! Sakura?! Not that one! <laughs> Oh, nobody ever uh, wants me. You know, one voice that I was never hey. proud of was um, Yui and Kayana Bridge to Bridge. Oh, God. A lot of um, people liked it, but I hated doing that voice. Oh, my God. Um, Yui Chan, look at my clitoris. Oh, God. <laughs> fuck. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Even though, even though. Pony Ken, you're just the best. Pony Ken. You know, all I do I have. I can't even do her, her voice anymore. I'm pretty yeah. sure I can't anymore. I was gonna say I do have one other voice acting job I used to be proud of, but at the same time, looking back at it, I, I was like, I could have done a shit ton better. Kit Fisto. What in it like a Star Wars thing? Yeah. Huh. I was I voiced Kit Fisto in. <laughs> Star Wars. I voiced Kit Fisto in Star Wars Sith confrontation again. I don't remember the guy who did it, but it was me and a friend of mine. We both, it was like, he voiced, I can't remember the guy's name. I mean, I remember my friend's name. I'm not going to say his real name on here. But I remember doing that. And it was just like, it had to be serious. It had to be everything. I was like, shouldn't Kit Fist... I was kept thinking in my mind, shouldn't Kit Fisto sound like different? But he was just like, your voice is good. Just enough. his I'm name, like, Kit Fisto. I feel like saying Kit Fisting. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That but would be uh, so one voice got, that I was proud of, it. and like a project that I was in for a little while, was um, it was a Mass Effect one. It was like something Protocol, and I voiced all the Vorcha in it. Wait. You said it was Mass Effect related or like Mass Effect? It, it, was Ma it was Mass Effect. It was Mass Effect related, but like not like actual related to Mass Effect. It was someone's fan thing. Oh, it was like okay. something protocol. When you said the word protocol, I'm like, you're not talking about Alpha Protocol, the Mass Effect like spy game. Like, no, 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 no. Yeah. No, it was like, I, it was a fan, like a fan story, but it was called something protocol. And I can't remember. I think it was just called Mass Effect Protocol. Uh, I voiced a bunch of the Vorcha in that. I also yeah, was supposed Vorcha, to play. The, uh, the cre the really okay, creepy somebody want to get this? Yeah. Game? Like, uh, do I have crazy. Crazy. Yeah, that's oh, the crazy 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 crazy. Vorcha. That was yeah, okay. Yeah. Well, Commander Shepard. That's pretty good actually. Huh, not, not, awesome. the, not the uh, not the the um the Volus. You're just like. <gasps> oh, yeah, no. So, well, what do uh, what, what they call him? They call him. Uh, the Rackley. That's Earth Clan. Earth Clan. <laughs> yeah. Dirty Earth Clan. I'm actually enjoying Andromeda. I actually am. Yeah, Andromeda's not bad. It's just the and plus you are playing the the very much patched version at this point. If this is I the am first time playing it. Yeah. You know what it is? CG though? loved my tweets. I actually <laughs> like Ryder. I like Ryder probably maybe even more than Shepard because like Shepard, I didn't feel like I was Shepard. I felt like Shepard's like this icon. I could be a rider. I could not be Shepard. <laughs> yeah, and I guess that that's what that's what a lot of people had a problem with riders because he is just, or he or she is just an every person. They're well, not like really. 
they're not really like Commander the, Shepard, the, like the other head thing of the military. The it's like you're either playing the brother or sister. You're not playing a character who could be either or. It's like no. It's like if you're playing one, there's still another, and that's your sibling. Yeah. But yeah, well, it would make like it. Ryder. It would make it. He has some really, really funny lines. Like I uh, think he's hilarious. So at Sakura, like, I'm. Uh, like, I, I use Discord for guys. all my streams now because I stream <laughs> through my PC. Because I stream other consoles too. So. I are so good. He it could have been. It could have been so interesting <laughs> in the sequels <laughs> because you could actually like maybe the very first choice of the game because there is a both male and female rider. That if I said I wanted to switch from male to female rider, that at the beginning of the game, the rider that I played in Mass Effect Andromeda One dies, so you take over the role. Um, so you can switch genders. So there's like an actual story plot on why one of them passed away and slash or, right? You could create interesting story dynamics by having like one rider take over for the other rider, but not have the same experiences because they and weren't in Andromeda 1. Leave my rider alone. Leave uh, my right. guy alone. But that's what I'm, I'm saying is like, that's what I liked about the brother, uh, the brother and sister mechanic. Is Come I was in like, rider so black. R because they let X. you customize both of them. We need, like speed of speed and we need to get back to doing Elves of Bridge. I'm I'm like legit honest. We really need to get back to doing Elves. Oh Bridge. man, I gave that up. Uh why you do this to me? I was so hyped for that because I love O's. <laughs> It, rider alone. Rider alone. Yeah, it, that's like it. asking for another one of those episodes of uh, Lord Moonstone's thing that we were all in. Oh, Fuma no Kojiro. Yeah. <laughs> However, I mean, <laughs> I mean, I I watched that again <laughs> recently. <laughs> oh, the best series. Come on, guys. It's, it's still it's still uh, Majora's Mask. Come on. <laughs> God damn. It. I, <laughs> no, the br the best abridged series is Paper Mario abridged. Hey. Yeah. yeah. Hey, what do you I'm want? Adam was slap dog. I love you, George. I love you, man. <laughs> Like I would like, I will get laws of O's and we'll do this. I'll edit the shit out of this. My problem is like the episodes were the the first episode was too long. I shouldn't have made it that long, and it wasn't funny. But it got over. A, but it was yeah. the it, it was the the only video I ever made that almost got a million views. So, uh, can you uh, do Forze one time? I did faux, faux shizzle was better. I preferred that. That was more fun to make. I want to do more foes, but I want to do like a later episode, like one more meteor comes in. Actually, I was, I've been re-watching clips from foes recently, because I've been feeling, I've been feeling the Kamen Rider again after not watching it for so long. I'm, I, I need to watch yeah. this new one. That's out, because I hear it's really good. Uh, yeah, I heard, uh, I heard they're doing like the, uh, Transforming into previous writers again. Yeah, it's the anniversary thing. Yeah. Oh, hey, look, a Bastion got play of the game. Surprise. <laughs> That's, yeah. Surprise! 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 I'm, 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 I'm actually kind of confused so. to what Sakura was talking about using an adapter to. Uh. uh Oh god, the Murder Princess opening. I was proud of that opening. The streamers I play with OBS would use the. Oh, wait, no. But, like, that means, like, everyone would have to get on the PS4 and then, like, do do the do the, do the the voice chat thing. Hmm. Like, Discord yeah. Is... Uh, I prefer using the Discord chat, honestly. It makes it easier. Discord rapes that at all. <sighs> Including Skype. I wouldn't be using the R word. Yeah, Time Warp, don't say that, please. I'll be right back. There's something I'm not, I don't want to say either, but I'm shaking my controller, pretending I'm doing a dry martini. Are, are you playing Why, Yakuza uh, again? He's playing Fist of the North Star, I can tell. I, 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 I want to say, I want to say yeah. that. You can't, you're, there's none of this like, oh, I'm shaking my controller. You guys got to play Senren Kagura Reflections and then realize Ooh. how fucking disturbing it is <laughs> to I use know. motion controls with your controller, okay? There is. A... You gotta just use the roller. So it's like, oh, I, I, I'm stirring a martini. I wish I did with my controller, but no, that's not what I did with my Joy Cons. <laughs> yeah, you're touching titties. <laughs> no, it wasn't even titties. That's the sad part. C CJ, CJ, look, look. Oh my god, you looked up Paper inner, Mario over inner, inner thigh is cool. 
but why can't it be the butt? What? No, I CJ. You like, no. you like inner thigh more than you like ass? Are you serious? Is this no. what you're going with this? <laughs> no, I'm confused. Like I was you just saying, I was just. Wait, wait, hold understand. on, hold on, Sakura. Are you guys actually getting that shit together? If so, Where's, that's hilarious. Where is Chimera? I haven't I'm talked totally to him in a while. Totally not watching Adam West laptop right. Now. Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> <laughs> Totally not. Well, you know what, guys? I'm going to I'm going to bridge something this year. <laughs> I'm I, I mean I said to myself I want to get one more episode of Mega Man the Abridged Game out. Um, I want to because the next one's the Iceman episode and that'd be a good winter thing. <laughs> Iceman. It's ice to meet you. No chip damage. <laughs> no chip damage. <laughs> <laughs> I remember that when we first played. Was it with Pilgrim or who do we play it with? Oh, that was with Pilgrim. Pilgrim. That was... I remember you picked Iceman, you're like, Iceman, Ice Beam, Ice, ice Beam, Ice, ice Beam. beam. Yeah, he got so mad at me. <laughs> oh, chip damage. He was so mad. He, yeah. pick, he picked pick Cable just to deal with me. I'm like, but guess what? No chip damage. Ice Beam, Ice Beam. <laughs> kept doing <laughs> it, and I was like, that's great. Like a ice Bomb. You were so fucking trolly that night. <laughs> <laughs> I remember I was spectating that, was, that match. Yeah, and he's that was like, my Trans Am moment. I was like, I think I'll play Venom. I mean, Iceman. <laughs> you mean Big Zam? Mean, yeah, like Big Zam. Uh, uh, oh, hey, Big Zam! Zam. <laughs> I told you to uh -huh, I think this time we can change it up. Oh, hey, Iceman. <laughs> God, and now you can, I, uh, can you still play that game online? No. Oh, they nope. they shut down the servers for it? Yeah, they did. Fuck. Actually, the PS4 versions, maybe. Of what game? Of uh, Marvel oh, vs. Capcom 2. Uh, uh yeah. <laughs> uh, is, aren't those games delisted? The 360 yeah, servers are closed, so. And, and the game is delisted all I'm talking around. about the PS4, because they re-released them on PS4 and Xbox One, didn't they? Uh, I, I don't uh, I actually do I think, not know this answer. I, I'm pretty sure they only uh, re-released Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3. Oh. I don't think they ever did 2. Which is a shame, because 2 is still the best one. 2 is broken as all shit, though. It is, it is, but... God damn, is it crazy? I mean, crazy Iceman. <laughs> I, mean, I, I mean, like, it, that was one works, weird trait that only he had, where he didn't take chip damage. Because I guess ice. But also, <laughs> I it, guess. Marvel vs. Capcom 2 is where this phrase came from. <clears throat> good work, soldier. Yeah. Nice. Uh, actually, it's I'm gonna take you for a ride. Do, 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 do. Well, I wasn't talking about that, but yeah. That's, that's all I remember from Marvel vs. Capcom 2. It's just working in the working in a movie theater over a summer, and that's all I could hear. <laughs> Marvel vs. Capcom 2 board just kept. Fucking making that noise. All I think about for I'm gonna take you for a ride is uh, kick scammers. That's all I think about. Mm. And here comes Random with the obscure thing. It's not obscure. It's uh, it's it's um, uh, Larry Bundy. It's um, on YouTube. Oh, uh, uh, Guru Larry. Larry. Yeah, Guru Larry. Yeah, but he does kick scammers. Oh yeah. Not obscure. I haven't talked to Larry in a while. Oh, the last time I talked to him, he was. I just like that guy. I wish I could birthday. talk to him. He sounds like a cool guy. He is. I need to. I've been. I I, I'm trying to. Uh, he's one of the people I've lined up for potential interviews for my podcast. So, that's one of the things. Cause like I've been following him since like the like the Screw Attack days, and uh, oh, he, he was one of the he was one of the first other like <laughs> internet people that I talked to, and then actually added me on Facebook and stuff. So, nice. <laughs> I don't I talk to him that much you. anymore, though. He probably he might not even know. Uh, remember me. <laughs> I was gonna say I don't even know why he added me on Facebook. I'm like a relative nobody. Well, that's the thing. Like Larry wasn't wasn't really all about the like, be like you're popular, I'll add you thing. He's just like talking to people. Yeah, he would uh, comment on like anybody's videos too. Not like most of the other uh, big uh, big internet reviewers. Eh. He said he hates Peter Molyneux. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, who likes that guy these days? 
<laughs> what what has he made these days? Wasn't there this kid this kid video game that never came out for uh <laughs> Uh, was it not? It was what was it called? It was from Connect, that evil, evil, destructive machine that should never see the light of day ever again. Ugh, I don't know. You mean but everything that's on the Connect? I think his name is like Keko or something like that. It was like this kid that you're no, supposed to be able Milo? to influence. Milo. Milo. Yeah. Milo, yeah. Right. Yeah. Fucking biggest fake news, Peter Molyneux. <laughs> <laughs> Like, that was the last time I ever heard about Peter Molyneux making anything. <laughs> yeah, and just like every single thing he's touched, lies. Yeah. I've never seen one truth. That's okay, thing. Sakura. You can play with your. Uh, you I like your black squad. and white. I like black and white and black and white too. Oh, black and white. The I only thing about it is it's so black plain. and white when I was a kid. Yeah, but that's it. I remember like, when Black and White Two came out. One of my friends bought it, scary. and I went over to his. He asked me over, even though he was like playing this single player game I'm like on PC and I didn't PC game back then I'm like why did you call me over <laughs> <laughs> I have no interest in this he's like I'm gonna show you this game I'm like well you know I don't play these games <laughs> at that time I didn't even have a PC so oh god damn it god I heard it and I still got hit by it I get annoyed whenever I ask people for, like, their favorite Pokemon lineups, like their team of six, and they're always like, I want, like, four legendaries, or, like, three super powerful Mega I do know legendary one. runs a lot of the time. I, I, I want to yeah. I wanna, I wanna point out that I'm I am legally obligated not to talk about Pokemon because apparently I'm too much of a tryhard. Oh, okay. Everyone's yeah. a tryhard. I, I, I pick one on the legendary, and that's Latias. Okay. No, 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 like literally, literally, like my friends, I, people have disassociated with me because I, I apparently I'm too much of a tryhard because I had I had an Arbark once named Orochimaru that swept the entire team. And I'm just like, it sounds like a bunch of people not, got butthurt. It's not my fault. See, this is the thing, like, especially when Pokemon uh, X and Y came out, I can't remember. I think it was John or somebody else, but like. He would like work on his team, and be like, "Okay, I've EV trained all these Pokemon. There's no way you can beat me." And then I sweep the floor with him with my team that I just played through the game with. Wow. And he'd be like, "Why do you keep beating me?" Yeah, I'm like, "I don't know." My Crobat called Hidan was a wrecker back in the day. I never, I never fought people. I just played the game. <laughs> like, like I swept my, I swept, I swept one of my friends who was like one of the. He wasn't a big, he wasn't a YouTuber who did a lot of Pokemon stuff, but he was friends with like Shofu. And all that kind of stuff. I swept him with a swoop back. And then he if got mad. The, if I were in the Pokemon school. universe, I would, and people would be like, aren't you going to evolve your Jigglypuff? Like, no, nah, I'm good. No. <laughs> Jig well, Ash is going to evolve his Pikachu. Yeah. Aren't you going to, aren't you going to evolve that? Uh, aren't you going to evolve that, uh, you know, that, that Chikorita? No, I'm good. I'm good. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, but I need There was guess. one point I didn't evolve my Pikachu in Pokemon X. And then as, as I was getting my bug kick, I was like, you know what, fuck it, I'm evolving them. Boop. Br Brandon, <laughs> why are all of your Pokemon, why are they all of like Everstone's duct tape to them? I... <laughs> <laughs> why don't they have Everstone's duct tape? That's the question. <laughs> it's because he doesn't believe in evolution. Yeah, yeah. He's, oh, he's a Christian. Wow. It's because you're oh. a Christian. <laughs> evolution is mystery. Right. Anyway. Maybe he just really likes the Little Cup. Did you guys ever think about that? Oh, uh, man, I, I missed the Little Cup. Or no Petite one... Cup or something? I think it was yeah. Petite. Yeah. It's, it was it was Petite Cup in 1 and Little Cup in 2, but no one ever wants to play that in Pokemon Showdown. Well, no, because a lot of the times people just evolve their Pokemon. They don't ever stone duct tape. <laughs> look, look, duct you know tape. which item which is in the card game that needs to be in the show or the game is de-evolution spray? That needs to be, like, a thing. I'm actually kind of amazed that they've never added I'm shocked, like too. That. They haven't done that. It was a card. Huh. It should be in the fun. That'd, that'd be the coolest thing in the anime, or, the, or you know, just like all the, like, you're, like, somebody's like playing, like, oh, here's my Charizard, and you're like, nope, squirt, squirt. Yeah. Oh, I, 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 no, I, I would love the fact that, he, that Ash accidentally evolves Pikachu, and like half the arc is him trying to get the, the spray to make him back into Pikachu. I would see. I would be in the po I, in the Pokemon universe. I would just be the biggest troll. Everyone would just have all these badass Pokemon. I just spray all of them. They'd be like, "Go, go, Blastoise!" Squirt, squirt. God damn it! <laughs> oh yeah, no. If you could actually do it to other people's Pokemon, that's like awful. 
Oh, nice one. I'm mad, like, I get that's probably that's probably why <laughs> it doesn't exist in the games because then the evil organizations would just do that to every ten year old that walks up to their door. Which in itself is a very odd practice that you're allowed tw ten year olds to wander yeah, off on their own. I, I can understand <laughs> that the whole parasite thing with uh, Parasect. Yeah, yeah, it's a little creepy. Um. <coughs> Oh, well, it's the same. It's the same thing with like Slowpoke too. Uh, it was like, like a fucking shelter jumps onto his tail and it makes him stupider. Oh God, who posted not safe for work? Well, Jigglypuff is still my favorite Pokemon. Oh wait, ever somebody posted uh, the not safe for work board. Yeah, no, it, it was it was time warp. He was he was giving our da us our daily dose of Bowser. Yeah, Carry on. Gosh. <laughs> there is no such thing as a daily dose. There needs it's like. Uh, it has to be it's, injected it's directly into dose. my veins at all times. <laughs> and for that reason, I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like needles, and fucking one went up my bum one time, and for that reason, I'm in. Wait, oh wait. my god. <laughs> that sounds like a story for another time. <laughs> well, by the way, I'm making that up. Needles actually don't really bother me, and I thought they like, would. I and fucking like, hate like, the, like, sad, the sad thing, thing about that no, Bowser. actually not that bad. Why the fuck is that? Is, we shouldn't be looking at it and fapping to it. We should be helping her off the fucking ground because she's weighted down and fallen over because of her gigantic breasts. <laughs> so you should be ashamed <laughs> of yourself. Quit trying to take the high road, CJ. <laughs> <laughs> Look, look, the high ground. Yeah. Look, like Fuck. CJ, CJ can no longer take the high ground because of because of his his. She, uh, look, she fell ground. over and no one's helping her because she can't get up because her back's broken. Look, look, look! Here, you can help her. Use the roller. Well, well at least uh, we can say that Buzet's already dead, so it doesn't matter. No, the roller, <laughs> the roller only works, Kirby, when their heart is disconnected from their body. That. Sounds <laughs> painful, actually. But it's not, but it's not heart heart. It's, it's CJ, a metaphysical what the fuck have heart. you been look, reading? Are you still reading that Smash Brothers thing? <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Don't get me started. It went <laughs> off the deep end recently, and I am having a hard time continuing. They killed there, there Rachel. There was Shallow End? They killed Rachel, okay? Who the Rachel fuck was... is Rachel? Okay. <laughs> All right. So Rachel... <laughs> Was I'm assuming the self insert girlfriend of the guy that was writing the fan fiction, and she was she was probably the best written character. She actually asked the question why things were happening, and I know it oh, sounds God. silly for me to be like, oh yeah, the character that asks why, but it actually gave some fucking context to what's happening in the story. I, I, I thought you were just then... fucking everything. <laughs> <laughs> Based on everything that happens, she at least got people to explain certain things that would have been huge continuity errors otherwise. But then I guess he had a bad breakup with her, and she has a fight with uh with I think his name is Steve. Yeah, it's Steve. And she went off, and then Meta Knight cut her head off. Me Meta. <laughs> okay, no, it's not. That. All right, it's not Meta Knight. It's Meta Knight controlled by is, is the Matt evil Mercer's energy. Is this fucking machinima shit? <laughs> you no. know, you know, like there will be brawl where it's super dark and gritty. Is that what? You know? <laughs> well, I mean, I guess the writer's going through a dark phase right now. Okay, he's killing people. I. That is a completely rational, uh, um, you know, response. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it! I love these chat messages. Tell me where the bomb is. Where's Rachel? <laughs> Oh, the Nightmare, what did you post in Not Safe for Work? Uh, what are you saying? Bowsette. It was a Bowsette. No, no the that's other not one. mine. Oh. It's, a, it's a hot chick with glasses. You just don't, that, don't know who it is? It's, just... it, it's, it's not who even is not... this random hot chick with glasses? It is not even Not Safe for Work. It's kind of like mildly safe for work. <laughs> yeah, whatever. I try to be careful. I just, whatever. You're, you're just trying. Safe for work. You're tr you're trying to be careful in a chat that is not safe for work. All right, I'll like just go. I'll just go into the folder titled "What" with three question marks and uh, <laughs> press something over there. <laughs> God damn it! No, I think we've I, all been on the it, internet long enough you, that nothing you know can that shock us. It gets like, to a all. certain point where you're like, I'm looking at my hentai folder, and I'm like, you know what? I should share some of this because I don't know what the fuck. No, no, going what, on what, in the, it. the what folder? Yeah. The, specifically the what one the? with three question marks is the one where I'm just like, when I see something, I'm like, what the fuck is that? Like, and I'm like, I gotta save this and share this to people later. 
Oh, I this, have, this, you know, this, at this point, just like nothing surprised me anymore. Like I'm just <laughs> like, you know what? I'm so desensitized. I'm like, whatever. That, safe for that, work. That, is, that is the hell in the handbasket folder. <laughs> I'm, I'm literally, I told you, I'm scrolling through DeviantArt, and that's just half of what the fuck right here. Yeah. Okay, here's your first problem, DeviantArt. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of problem. it's like a train wreck. It's like a glorious train wreck, but it's like it's like every it's like this train is exploding and crashing. But every now and then there's like a beautiful mountain. You're like, oh, that's a really cool picture. Oh, now there's an exploding train. Okay, back to that. Yeah, or maybe that. somebody drew a really good picture of an exploding train, but it's just like Horizon, a first step to the storm. Oh, to nice, the stars. nice picture, Kirby. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just. Is that, I'm just, is that Tharja? Yeah, that's Tharja. Crazy, crazy Tharja. What's Tharja? From uh, uh, from Fire, Fire Emblem, yeah, and, and then I post uh, I think that's uh, that's uh, Attila. I can't remember Altera. Altera. My bad. You can't call her Attila. She gets upset when you call her that. I just posted Yumi. Yeah, from, I saw uh, that. <laughs> I'm trying to look through my. I'm trying to. Look, I forget the characters from. Uh, here we go. Fi the Fire Emblem uh, Fates characters. Let's see. Who did I keep marrying? Let's see. I married. Uh, oh, the uh, oh yeah, the flashback, the fox girl, because she was adorable. And who else? I used to have a I I used to have a photo dedicated to weird pictures with Toga in it, so I'm not going to share that. Oh, that's right. Oh, and Charlotte, that's right. I love Charlotte. She was adorable. What was, what was the the girl from? I think she was from Birthright, but she was like um like a barbarian. Oh, Rinka. Yes. Yeah, I was like, that was that was the girl that I went after. Rinka was a little <laughs> too stacked for me. I was like, that was a little too much. Wait, wait, uh, was she, you saying that Rinka was just basically too much muscle for you? Too much, yeah, a little too muscly, yeah. A little, a little too muscly? Yeah. Oh, not for me. Yeah. I, I was at least definitely more of a Charlotte fan, you know, like the uh, the one with the crazy long blonde. I, I just see that's the thing is like some of them. I was just like when they're like calling me brother and stuff. I'm like I can't marry any of you because this feels weirdly and oh, utterly wrong. The, the two maids were adorable. The maids were adorable. The maids were adorable. Yeah. But like okay, we I could not corner. stand the like there was one super Sundere, like legitimately didn't even love you Sundere, and that was that red haired chick. Like I was like, no, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> it was and it's not as cute as like Cordelia was in Awakening. Oh, fuck, I'm gonna die. Why do we have three healers? This is not good. Though she sucks in in um Fire Emblem Warriors. I do remember though, I do remember that in um in uh, in the original Fire Emblem Awakening, what I did was I was like, oh guys, who should I marry? Wait, wait, wait a second, wait. You can marry the queen? She's alive? Oh yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, some elsewhere story where they're just like, oh yeah, and she's alive again. Time to marry me, sir. It's an amnesiatic queen. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> she clearly doesn't have her memory, and you're like, let me take advantage of that. <laughs> <laughs> you're like, take advantage of all night. <laughs> Oh, you're right. Yeah. Oh yeah, Mr. Krabs. <laughs> what the music on the ground? I have some good news and some better news. The good news is we found your sister. She's alive. The better news is I'm boning her. <laughs> 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 That's basically hey. it. And then Krom looks at you angrily, but then gives you a thumbs up because he's your best bro. Because <laughs> he's Krom. <laughs> he's like, you know what? Yeah, I'm glad. I love Krom. He's great. Krom is really like, Krom's you amazing. know. I don't care for that reason. It I'm... was so hard to get it to, to pair him with Ophelia, to pair him with a dancer. Because to pair him with a dancer, you have to like like get their thing up in like Let's one push. single battle. You have to do it really push fast. Guys. Yeah. I did it in, in the first my uh, first it, like Her name was Ophelia, right? Yeah, I think it's Ophelia. Yeah. Ophelia, not Ophelia. It's, it, yeah, it's, it's like in one battle you gotta do it. Yeah. It's the battle you find her in and and big old uh dad. I refused to, to let Sophia marry him. I'm like, no, no, you fangirl. I know. <laughs> Every, the best romance <laughs> was Mary Bell and Gregor. That was my favorite random OTP. I actually always paired Gregor with uh, Naoi. Oh, that's I, not a bad choice. I, I accidentally paired Naoi with, uh, what was, uh, what was the dude name? I can't remember the dude who was afraid of chicks. Uh, I'm looking up the farm. Navarre. Navarre. Fucking healer. Navarre, yeah. It was an accident, actually. Because so I was like, look. Now I, have none. I was like, you're dying, Navarre. Here, have some support. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
And, and then, of course, there was that one guy nobody likes and we all leave him single. It was the axe guy you get in the beginning. Oh, uh, uh not Vike. Uh, like, the like Marv or something like that? Val? No, the, the Vike. The Vike. Vike, yeah. Nobody yeah. likes Vike. Nobody. Nobody. <laughs> Poor Vike. We're like, Vike, go fuck yourself, literally. <laughs> Don't you understand? The Vike is here to teach you some manners. <laughs> <laughs> I do gotta say, though, I always I forget that romance, he's in um, Evil Girl, and she was pretty cool, actually. Darja or no, 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 Evil, Evil Girl. Um, fuck, I can't remember her name because, uh, yeah, I can't remember her name, but crazy, crazy uh, used to be minion woman. I might have to look this up. Hold on. Because I do, she... I do love her romance line though. She's like, I'm the fiercely loyal type. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I like this. That's good. Yeah. Uh, and honestly, between in con between Conquest and Birthright, I didn't even like Birthright that much. I think Conquest was a much better game. I I have a love hate relationship with Fates. Uh, Fates Fates really pissed me off because they like not only did they separate the game into two storylines, but then they made a DLC true storyline. Yeah, the third end. game you yeah, had to buy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, they, to, to me, I don't to me, like the, the choice wasn't hard originally. It was like, hi, we're like like we're this random people who turns out to be your family, but you live with this other one for like twenty years, but you should live with us. And I'm like, fuck you, I know you for five minutes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, uh, also uh, uh hold on. Vegeta. The yeah. character you're thinking of is Aversa. Aversa, thank you, Aversa. That was it. So, uh, I, to be honest, I really think Fates should not have had the whole uh, child system. Because, like, it didn't really work that well as it did in Awakening. Oh. Yeah, but, it didn't. I mean, the only the only thing that I'll say that I that I think was good about the, was that, about the uh, children was that you could date the fox girl. She what was do those girl. numbers mean above their heads? And what? In Overwatch. Uh, numbers above their heads? I don't know. I don't know. I haven't, I haven't done the new event, so... I don't know what that means. I might, I might have to pre... I've, now I'm just, I've been sitting here thinking about it here. I might just have to preference all my streams with that, what I was telling you earlier before the stream. What? About my open policy on um people buying me games. Oh, about me, yeah. Yeah. By the way, by the way, like it, if that happens, like it's like it'd be a no pressure situation. I just want you to have it so we can play it sometime. Dude, 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 I would put in the time, put in the time. I I actually really play this really casually, honestly. Um, it's one of the few FPSs I'm get, I'm actually decent at. I used to play a lot of Paladins, which is Overwatch Lite. Yeah, I have Paladins on my Switch. I play it a lot. Yeah, it's it's pretty fun. I play I play it on both PC and uh, PS4, but my PS4 yeah. is the one that actually has a lot. More I actually have quite a few characters unlocked on PS4, but I stopped playing it on there. I mostly play it on Switch now. I almost have enough to unlock a character. Oh, that's the one who I don't ever want to romance. That's who it was, Azura. Fuck you, Azura. CJ. Yeah, what's up? The, when you brought up like the Fates thing being separated through DLC, you know how it wasn't separated. The fucking special edition. Everything was on the cart, and it was just oh. called Fire Emblem Fates. Oh my god! Yeah, yeah, I have that edition, and I have not played it. <laughs> I have that edition too. I just make sure. Right, I did play it just for the hell of it. I got to where you actually separate into the different games, and I'm like, okay, I'm done because I'm bad at strategy games. I'm just not gonna go past the <laughs> prologue. That's it. I just I, I come I, to I, Smash like... instead, and I don't have those characters as DLC. <laughs> I saw they wanted you to pick a Zura. They're like, hey, you should pair up with a Zura. I'm like, no, no. But, but it's the same thing. It's like with Krom. It's like they're trying to desperately make you choose either the main character or other girl that I can never remember the name of because she was so pathetic. Yeah, and I'm like, no, I'm never. I'm not going to do it. Fuck you. I'm going to marry Krom's sister instead, not the younger no, not, one. Not, she, he, he, it wasn't Cordelia that was being paired with Krom. It was that other girl, like Sumia or something. Sumia? Uh, I thought they wanted to pair you with Lucia, too, like the uh, his daughter. Oh, yeah. Lucina? Lucina. That one, that's just weird. I could never do that. I mean, I like the dynamic if you play a female Robin. Oh, I like her. the dynamic of her coming and being like, you're her mom. 
I like that. I like that thing. I Catch never me. played female in, in Fire Emblem, so I wouldn't know. Okay, because that story arc was really, really neat that they took the time and effort for that. The only time I have ever played a female in Fire Emblem was solely so I could romance Grandpa in Conquest. <laughs> Is that you, Enid? That was, I was like, you can romance an old man, I can play a female for this. Yeah, and for that reason, I'm in. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> you can a grandma in, um, in, in, uh, in, uh, in Jesus. You're like, come on, grandma, let's go. <laughs> man, I love these dumb Shark Tank jokes the fucking end for that reason. It's the best thing I've heard on a podcast that's no longer on a podcast, but it's too good. I'm gonna have. We're gonna have to have you as a. We're gonna have to have you as a third person on the Hunter Base podcast, just so you could be there to say that. <laughs> okay. Uh, the, okay. On one of the Patreon exclusive like episodes, when they removed it from the podcast and just decided to do a Patreon exclusive video for funsies, uh, one of the episodes, uh, one of the guys is like. I forget exactly what, and he's like, and for that reason, I'm in. But then immediately after, he like explains some like stuff that he's very concerned about, and then he's like, and for that reason, I'm in. Like he didn't doesn't even change his opinion. He just <laughs> says he's in twice, which is so stupid. It's amazing. I don't know. I, w I would. I would never romance Chrome. I don't know. I would, although, I would. I would romance Gangrel. Although zero, I still think the human centipede fucking thing. What? It's still the funniest one, where he's like, random reasons, he's out, and then another person explains that, okay, taping mouth to buttholes is disgusting, and the other is like, wait a minute, I'm in! And it was enough to break the other dude out of character, and they kept the take in. Just started cracking up behind his clipboard. Fuck. <laughs> oh god, here comes D.Va. My favorite, probably, Fire Emblem character. I don't know. Oh, I Man. Oh, I'm so glad I'm a... Patron for Easy A. I'm so tempted to up my pledge. Hmm. One dollar. I'm just like ah. Oh. I, I think the next the next time I play Fire Emblem, I'm gonna romance Anna, just to see what happens. I love that victory uh, pose. I, Anna bothers me because Anna doesn't feel like she loves you. Anna's kind of just like, uh, oh cool, now he can make shit. And I'm like, oh okay. Alright. Cool. <laughs> cool. <laughs> awesome. I could take it or leave cool. it. You know? Dude, like nice to see like, you. Camila, holy <laughs> shit, Camila! Camila wants to bone you even like when she thinks you are like you are brother and sister. <laughs> I think she wants to bone all of her family members. Yeah, to I be think she. I think honest. Yeah. Uh, family, <laughs> honestly, yeah. She's like, I love my family. Like, whoa, Camila, whoa, sweetie, <laughs> sweetie, please. Not in front she, of the children. She is. She is a step on me waifu, though. I feel like step on me waifus. She is. She would. Um, uh, she would be a ridiculously loyal wife. That that's not even a question. Yeah. She would like murder like another girl just for looking at you. <laughs> <laughs> you could actually tell her like she looked at me and she'd be like, "All right, don't worry, everything will be fine now." And you just see her spread across the wall. Any of your enemies <laughs> would just be all across the all across the pavement. The only people, the only girls who are allowed to look at you are me and your other sister Elise. Yeah, and your other <laughs> and your sister. I don't want to threesome. You'll change your mind. <laughs> you know what they say: incest is incest. I don't think they really say that, but okay. <laughs> Depends on the end. I'm just trying to make you guys feel better about your life choices, okay? <laughs> I don't. I don't feel better about my life choices. I'm actually quite saddened that this was. This is how it ends. <laughs> this is how I've chose to live my life, and I'm not satisfied. You know, and I don't think I ever really, will be really satisfied. Awkward, though, is that Hinoka is totally the voice of like she uses the Buttercup voice from uh, from Powerpuff Girls. That's really awkward. Oh, God. oh Terra Strong. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Terra Strong uses the Buttercup no, voice. You're like, mm, that's kind of weird. Correction, Bubbles is Terra Strong. Yeah, I don't know sorry. Who uh, well, uh, oh god, there's, there's, they were talking, okay, okay, so on, 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 um, his, uh, on his Let's Play show, on Jordan's Let's Play show, uh, Sticks and Stones, him and the guys were talking about this one character in Jack and Daxter's voice by Tara Strong, so they just started saying, Tara Strong, more like Tara Weak, <laughs> and oh. they just kept going, and it's the <laughs> dumbest thing, <laughs> but I'm obsessed with it. <laughs> Damn it. 
fuck. I just think I about know. that I'm, every... I'm, I'm, voting, I'm voting that, that Conquest is better than, than Birthright. That's, that's, that's my vote. I, I would actually agree with you, Vegeta. Conquest yes. is much better. Yay! Nah. That's the, that's I, the like, I have to say, I like the male characters in Birthright better. Uh, a lot of the guys, like... Um, that magic magician dude that's like, I like magic, but then he's also like a murderer that just wants to incinerate everybody. I just never really got into his character. It's like, oh, he's so nice, but he wants to like I, eviscerate and like disintegrate everybody. I hate though Takumi. I hate him with a fiery passion. Uh, Takumi was a bitch. He was a fucker, that guy. Was that the arrow guy? Yeah, it was the arrow yeah. guy. who was like, you betrayed us even oh, when you yeah. didn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah oh remember. my god. He was a liar. He was so butthurt. You're like, what? <laughs> <laughs> terrible character. I hate him. He was terrible. But then, uh, but then again, he was like okay in like the uh, last route because he didn't bitch as much. Much, I guess. Yeah, as much. Yeah. He didn't yeah. bitch as much. Yeah. I, I, it just seems like, it just seems like it's a better story in Conquest. Birthright's too like like yeah. I don't know. It was weird. Yeah. And no one yeah, talks about Revelation, the third one. Yeah. But, well, that's the thing. The third one is like your main character being like, you know what? Both, Both of you are dumb. I'm yeah. cooler. I actually did not play the third oh. one. I didn't play that one. Like the story is just it's like I understand why it's the. If that was a choice, like if they gave me the three choices, which was, you know, go back to your real family or stay with your adoptive family or to not join either side, I probably would have originally played the either side. not Because yeah. it's like, that makes more sense to me story-wise. But after playing through both Conquest and Birthright and then given the option to say fuck you to both, it kind of ruins it. No, I see what you're saying. To, I don't, yeah. to me, if, if it were me, if, if, it were, like, if I were really in that situation and someone were like, hey, you've been with these people for 20 years, they've known you forever, and here are these people you know for five minutes who say, hey, by the way, you're ours, who are you going to side with? I'd be like, well, <laughs> tough choice. <laughs> but I think I'm going to choose the yeah, people uh, I've known for 20 years, just saying. Yeah, because otherwise, Korra would just sound like a douche. It just seems weird to me, I don't know. I, I, I mean, the the leader of of like the place that you are though. Like, I got mad evil character vibes off of him like five seconds in. Not your like brother, your brother general. Oh, the king, like, obviously. The king. You're just like, man, this guy's fucking evil. Yeah, but I wouldn't be, would be with it for him. I'd be with it for my family, my actual family. You know, but I don't know, to me, it would just it would just be like the equivalent of right now. Like right now, if if like someone just kidnaps you and goes, "Hey, CJ, you're really this family," and then all of a sudden, like now you gotta choose. You'd be like, "Well, what do you think I'm gonna choose?" Oh my god, <laughs> it's just like Obito. Yeah. No, no, it's not like Obito at all. So, so it's just like Duel Monsters. It's no, it's it's a Joe Star. We've been over this. No, it's like choosing to shoot <laughs> Rex and Vermeer. It's a non-question. Of course you shoot him. <laughs> oh my God! Oh no! Oh, shit. Oh. Yeah. Well, it's foul mouth. I'm so Joe excited. Star, what's his name? Oh, no. What's his name's gonna be there as well? Um, the guy who voices him in English. PG Daily. That's right. That was Tommy from from Rugrat. Oh, what in Yomacon? Uh, yeah, Yomacon. Yeah. You know his voice actor I really miss, uh, like I really liked the lot, and she died was uh, uh, Christine Cavanaugh. Christine Cavanaugh, really she voice. She was uh, she was Chucky from Rugrats. She was Bunny from Sonic. Oh, she's she, she was uh, she's Dexter dead. from Dexter's oh, Lab. Oh, right, right. Yeah. I liked her voice a lot. She was she was actually in Critic too. She was the she was the son in Critic. She's a really good voice. I liked her a lot. You know, like, you know what's really funny, though? When you come across those voice actors that aren't even, like, really, like, voice actors, they're just, like, they I use want, the same voice I for want everything. the smiley face Like, one. the guy from yeah. Bob's Burgers, want, or the girl in Bob's, or the girl in uh, Gravity Falls or Bob's Burgers. Like, the same voice for every <laughs> single thing. Yeah. I mean, like, how Bob well, and Archer It's like, like remember, remember Sugar and YTV, where it's, like, that's just all our voice. She voiced the, because, Chitty Moon. And... Because I'm used to home movies, I always see Archer as Coach McGurk. I get like I can't unhear it. Bob is Coach McGur. I always, much. I, uh, I'm, I'm like I watch Bob more, so I see everybody as Bob. Spaghetti time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
her name? What is that, that woman's name who does, uh, who does, um, uh, who does Gravity Falls and, uh, Bob's Burgers? What's her name? That's Kristen Shaw. That's a Kristen Shaw, that's right. And she does that same voice for everything. Got into the danger zone. She was, she Where? had the same voice, she was in Captain Underpants with the same voice, too. Hmm. It's kind of like, um, who else does that? Um, God, Lisa from the, Lisa from The Simpsons. She always had the same voice for everything, too. Yeah. Hmm. Man, or how good was or that? like Johnny Young Bosch. I'm fairly Johnny sure he had the well, same okay. voice for everything. Here's, here's the funny thing. You got Johnny Young Bosch okay. and he's for everything, but then you got his voice from Eureka 7 that's more like his younger Mighty Morphin Power Rangers voice. <laughs> yeah, but but yeah. when you go, and this is my voice, it, that doesn't make you sound younger. It's just you're putting okay. a rasp you're just making that weakens your th Yeah, you're you're weakening by giving yourself a rasp. Okay. okay, see, the worst experience of that is with Johnny on Bosch is playing, literally playing Tales of Symphonia Daughter in the World, where he does both ranges of voices because he's playing two different characters who's the same character, but two different yeah. ranges Damn of voices. It. Yeah, but it's Very... it's the same thing when he, because obviously he voices you in Persona 4, and he voices uh, Dachi as well. So, like, in the anime, you're just like, are you even trying, dude? Like... At least, at least you doesn't speak very much, so it's not like blatantly obvious that you play both of them. I thought he gave Adachi a, a sort of a distinctive voice. He just the, voiced uh, him like this, and yeah. then he voiced regular you like this. But it's really just the same voice, just with, like yeah. I said, more strain to the back of his throat. So he sounds different, slightly. I would say the one guy who can always voice kids forever, no matter how old he gets, is Greg Harris. He just keeps voicing. Oh, Greg Harris, yeah. Uh, he's great. Greg Harris will never grow up. He's a Toys R Us kid. He will. Kid. He will always perpetually play 10 year old and it's great. <laughs> he's good at it. Especially, especially Neggy, where he just has to add the uh, British voice. Oh, God. That, that voice, like, killed him, though. Hello. My name is Neggy Springfield. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, can you please voice the character for the entire series of that voice? <laughs> Shit, man! My name is Neggy! E.G. Daily vs. Bubblecup. The shit out of you! Oh god, dude, you, guys, you guys are giving me flashbacks to when I did, uh, when I did Neggy Ment and I had Jordan voice fucking Neggy. I think one of my favorite lines was like, um, when everybody was like telling him to like not try any funny business, he's like, does no one here realize I'm a ten-year-old boy? Really? No one? Just me? <laughs> <laughs> Another line I also love from that that I wrote is, um, is one character goes, I demand a recount, and then the other character goes, how do you recount breasts? <laughs> uh, Alright. What Made is the board? board? I'm going to just throw this out here. If you could... If you could abridge any anime, just not saying if it can be abridged or not, if you could abridge any anime, what is the worst title you can give for the, for that anime and why? Uh, the worst title? Just the worst uh, title. Gundam Emo, Gundam I mean, Cena Bridge. I mean, there was a point when uh, Alex and I were going to do a, uh, a series called mm. Sisterhood of the Traveling Alchemist. Uh, what anime is that? It was Brotherhood. No, I don't know. If you're going to make a Gundam... No, 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 there's there's a lot of bad puns you can do. Yeah, if you're going to make a Gundam scene, you just got to call it Gundam Plant. Yeah, that would have worked better. Just Gundam Plant. Gundam, yeah. Gundam Plant. Because everybody has the has the emotions of a plant. Man, I know that we've talked about it several times, but remember the Gundam Double O thing? <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. That was well, great. I'm a oh. dude. Um, well, see, I would do, I would do, a, I would do a One Piece with... Yeah, I would do a one piece with zero and CJ and I call it three piece bikini. Oh god. Uh let's see, I would probably do I don't I couldn't voice piece, anybody but... in one piece. <laughs> I don't think I could get away with any of them. Hey, hey, is hey, 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 guys, check out my queen impression. Oh, <laughs> you just wanna keep doing that fucking line. I love that line! <laughs> it's so bad. I was listening, I forgot some of the jokes, like fucking, like, Zoro has all these weird things, like, he only likes women with mustaches. <laughs> His atta yeah. ultimate attack is called Flibbity Flubity, like... <laughs> only if you wear this mustache. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. And Usopp was just this voice. 
Oh, they, what, that, that's right. For, for Naruto, that was the, uh, the Baki fan club president. No, yeah. Vegeta, I trusted you. Baki. <laughs> Wind pants? Wind, Wind pants. Wind pants. I totally pants. forgot I killed Baki. <laughs> oh my god. Do, do you know what you know what I had a reminiscent of the other day, CJ? Oh. Remember when we were all like playing like almost every day, uh Clash of Ninja Revolution 3. Three yeah, on our Wii's, and like the connections were awful, but we didn't care. <laughs> and yeah. you would always pick Baki and be like, Wind pants! Wind pants! Wind pants! Wind pinch. Wind pinch. And when you'd beat somebody, you'd be like, hey, Zero. Wind pinch. Wind pinch. I'm just like, shut up. <laughs> I'm going to pick Neji and win. <laughs> Neji was super easy to dodge, though. I guess, actually, no, you know what? What the real thing was? It was easy to dodge because you picked him so much. I, I would like how Oni and Killer Instinct would just jump. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. To Might add as well to that, jump. To jump, add, jump, uh, jump, jump, fly, fly. What are we adding to? Um, jump, 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 jump. Sorry. I love you, Zero. I love you, Zero, but you vex me. Jump, 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 jump. Slide, slide, jump, jump. I would do Digimon Frontier. Oh, oh, God. Oh, the worst one. Okay. Fuck all you, right, I'm first it. off. <laughs> because That's not I, right. like, like... I love Digimon Frontier. It's, it was great. It was oh, a friend. Could be on the same page. And for I know, I'm in. Okay, <laughs> I know this is like out of left field, but I just flipped over to the, the not safe for work thing. I'm like, all right, you and me riding a banana. I've seen that before. But that girl underneath, where the fuck are her tits? Like where where are the nipples? Where are they? Uh, they're hitting oh, Rita. Uh, the no, no, that's not how. Double sided tape is an amazing work. thing. God. That's not how nipples work. <laughs> it, 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 that's it, not it, how nipples work. <laughs> DJ, have you seen your own nipples? <laughs> right. Yes, I can see my own nipples. <laughs> what do you expect yeah, from me? Okay, I'm, 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 I'm going to raise the stakes. I've seen, seen other so people's I'm nipples in. recently. Jesus Christ. Yeah, yeah. They're, they're removable like pepperoni slices. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. okay, somebody's been watching Jason X. All right. Uh, oh, God. Oh, no. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. Let, let, let me finish and get it out before before I forget. It, I would call it D Digi Injur. I don't know why. Mm. I think the one thing I did want to do is the Digimon movie, but it's been so overdone now that I'm just like, ah, uh, yeah, I'm not No, do look, look, look. Digimon Frontier is untapped potential. And and yeah, because nobody fucking states. likes it. <laughs> okay, they're wrong. <laughs> uh, Tamers was better. Tamers, ta oh oh, that's what everyone say. Tamers is better. It was so full of character. And, I like season two. Honestly, season two is my favorite. Season two was good. I love and I love Davis. He's my favorite character. Mm. I have to disagree with you on that, Zero. I'm I know a lot of people don't like Davis, but I love Davis. I, I wanted to interrupt this because I bought this like knockoff brand of, of ginger uh, not ginger ale but uh, root beer, and I swear to God it smells like twenty pounds of fucking Nyquil. This is what it smells like to me, and I don't want to drink this anymore. Then don't drink it, man. I don't even no. drink anymore. How okay? How about an anime that would be really really bad taste to a bridge, and you probably you'd what Grave of the Fireflies abridged. Grave of the Fireflies a bridge. That's the one I, I was do. thinking about that, but I was also thinking about Koi Kaze a bridge. Mm. What what was that one really dark uh, old cartoon with the cats and it was like really fucking gory? I mean I mean it's doable. Fucking what's his name did Gantz a bridge. HBI did Gantz. The hatred that would come from that. <laughs> The rest of the series is filler. What? Oh! I was, I was quoting a, a Gantz bridge I saw a long time ago. Yeah, HBI's Gantz bridge is, uh, was the one that I was like, okay, nothing is sacred. <laughs> I mean, I, mean, I abridged a hentai once like, for I don't think anybody would do, like, magnitude 9.0 abridged. I mean, mm -hmm. I, I abridged a hentai once for someone's birthday, so I have no shame. Mm, jiggly. 
I'm glad yeah, yeah, I did. Uh, I did. Like a, uh, it was like a high school thing, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, it was extra credit abridged. Yes. Yeah, I remember extra, that. I, oh my god, oh, Jesus. Was, was I that done? I'll be with that. I, I can't remember if I voiced it. I can't remember if you were. Uh, I just I just looked it up. Philiday. Or Phil, Philiday. Philiday. That's not anime, though. Hmm. It, it's animated. It's a German animated. Right, it's not animated. So, fine, whatever. Uh, shit. I saw Philiday. That was a weird movie. It was like a, it was like it was like a murder mystery with cats. I don't know if we want to go like anything and everything. Uh, that'd be fucked up to do Schindler's List abridged. I don't know. <laughs> no, no, anime though. <laughs> Schindler's List abridged. Fucking Christ. Uh. Uh, that one hentai that Chimera showed me. Like with... he shows us a lot of hentai. I'm being- I'm trying to be more specific. It was basically a Sailor Moon parody. And, Thanks, Sakura. And- and like it ended Wait, with the Sailor in the Seven Balls? No. Oh my no. god, Sailor in the Seven Balls! Oh shit, I remember that! Uh, <laughs> I saw- I, I saw that on the shelf. All I remember that is, dil is Goku gets a dildo up the ass on a machine. I don't fucking remember. I'm sorry, that. what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah. No, and for that and reason, I'm out. <laughs> because the dragon ball is up her. Yeah, that's right. No, no. I'm trying to remember. I don't remember what it's called, but like I remember the last scene. It was like the dude basically be being the, the Cedo Mass XP, and he was getting a blowjob from a cat. So I, I don't understand. I'm trying to oh, <laughs> fuck. I I've seen that. I remember that. Fucking Chimera. <laughs> Things Chimera has showed us, but we don't want to forget, but we don't, we can't forget. Bible Sailor Moon Black 7 Balls animation is so horrendously bad, it's amazing. <laughs> Would you guys be down for bridging Slayer next? God damn it. Oh, no. Slayers! Oh, I love Slayers. Yeah, that's a great series. I'd be down for that. I love, I love Slayers. That's a, that's a good ass show, and Lisa Ortiz is awesome. It's only because Lisa Ortiz is in it. Let's be well, real. That's up. why you're saying yes to that. Shut up. <laughs> it's not because I'm looking at a picture of Lena Inverse right now on my right. Shut up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's what they all say. I forgot I forgot Lisa Ortiz was in Lynx Club. That was a show. Lisa Ortiz was in if it was four kids, Lisa Ortiz was in it. Oh, you know what? That makes sense because mm -hmm. I'm looking at it. She was in Yu-Gi-Oh! GX and she was a lot of characters. Including the the not the not a Shizu character. Final Alexa? No, Yasmin. Uh here. That's not supposed to be. The, the only girl I remember from GX is Alexa. I mean that's the Hello! only female character. That is like Where's the only Cyrus? That is like the only other female character other than what uh Blair Flanagan. The only thing I remember from GX Fucking is Blair. The fact that I did Jinzo. Blair's a girl? A good thing I played all that Assassin's Creed. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. What does that even mean? Zero. I think I'll give everyone's soul back. On one condition, we party! <laughs> yeah. oh, I was I was in I was in that duel one of the Duel of Fates movies. Not the not the one that Karibo did, but uh, the one that Sefex and Azur Azurata. Yeah. You were the you were the villain. I was a villain in that, yeah. I remember that. That didn't Stop theirs come out. Around the same, yeah. Didn't theirs come out around the same time as? They actually released it first. Yeah. Yeah. But we got accused of copying, and it really pissed Seth Fricks off. Even though it came out first. Even though it came out first. Yeah. It would have He should have done a video yeah. called "Look we at the Dates." Game, we had Gamer Buddy voicing uh, for us as well. He was uh, Yami Yugi. All right, time to open these four loot boxes, and then I'm gonna end the stream. All right, so big money, big money, no whammy, no whammy. Stop. Uh, who is who are the cast and slayers next? Let's see. You have. Oh, we got a victory you pose. Be a blue-haired girl. You pumpkin be... head. Damn, that scared me. What? Sorry. <laughs> oh, hey, I got a skin for Reinhardt. Brass. Reinhardt. I keep I keep forgetting that Pokemon Sun and Moon, the anime, had a lot of Sakuga, huh. like an increasing amount of Sakuga. 
I hate your friend in Sun and Moon. I'm like, get the fuck out of here. <gasps> Who? How? Oh, I got a hand soap screen. Yeah, 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 the annoying guy was I like, got... oh, I, I lost. This is I the greatest the... feeling ever. You're I got like, the I demon skin here. for hand soap. Can't even let me win in oh, this. that's cool. The Oni skin? No, it's like the... the uh, oh, uh, I thought it was called Oni. What? Yeah. Uh, like, hand soap or not. Oni or whatever, like the Jap like the Japanese demon on oh, the Oni. Japanese. Just an Oni, demon. right? I'm fairly sure they're called yes. Oni. Yes, that is correct. <laughs> okay, that is correct. You're right. I love that on a highlight intro. That's great. All right. Let's see what else I get. So you, you, Finally, you, I got you, another Arisa skin. You know what? I don't like. I, I'm not saying I like Hal, but I I liked I liked him more than I like Gladian. Let's be real. Like I I did not like Gladian. Gladian was Gladian? just he's Lily's brother. Hmm. Oh god! Like McCree has a Dick Tracy. Fucking he, he was he was he was in Pokemon <laughs> yeah. Sun and Moon and Ultra Sun and Moon. Blonde oh, hair, little okay. Yeah, he was the blonde haired little shit that was uh, part of Team Skull, but not part of Team Skull. Oh, that fucker. Yeah, okay. Yeah, him. That's right. I, I, yeah, he's an idiot. He's okay, an now, asshole. Now that's, a, now that's a spray for... Okay, Marty. All right, well... Doc, Doc, we gotta get back to the future, Doc! <laughs> Marty, oh, it's Marty. your kids! 1.21 gigawatts! <laughs> <All right. laughs> nice. And, and with and f and with that, I'm gonna call that a stream because it's late and, and I gotta go to bed. And for that stream, I'm out. Um, <laughs> thanks everybody for coming out. Uh, Nobody calls me chicken. Who's Um, thanks for thanks for watching. There, thanks guys for joining in on the commentary. Right like, we we had That's a full we had a full group. We sure big. did. Oh, so hopefully, I'll hopefully, see you guys hopefully. on uh, Tuesday. I might do more Mega Man. I might do more of this. We'll see. Uh, but I'll see you then. Peace out. Bye. Hey, Frosty.